Okay, this is a fantastic day for uh, the raft, the Arden. It's a fantastic day for all those Lamrocks who couldn't be with us today. We want to tell the Lamrocks throughout the world that these people that are in this raft today are absolutely the best that we could find at that point in time. There's a couple of them that I would like to replace, but um, we we are holding out that Travis may arrive at any moment. Travis Lamrock may arrive at any moment to take up the cudgel. Good luck to them. <laughs> I think without the Americans we have a very good chance of not just bettering last year's performance or the year before's but you know, I think we're pushing Exorna to the top spot here this year. Well, the day has arrived of the uh, annual Port Rush Raft race. The newly refurbished boat ready to go. New captain in place. Should have happened a long time ago. Uh, new tactics, new professionals brought on the whole way from Hong Kong. Uh, we're missing the Yanks, which I think will be a benefit to us. Um, What's your prediction? Is, prediction is a, an easy one this time. There's not as many rafts in the, in the race this time. Uh, we've got a really good spot and I think this is going to be uh, uh, one of the highest places we've ever had. So you were 11th last year. What do you predict for this year? Fourth. Good luck. This is Charles, brought in all the way from Hong Kong. He's our professional. Charles, where's this raft going to come in today? This raft, this raft, I feel, is going to come in number one to very worst number three, I reckon. Because if you see out here, we've got a we've got a lovely little rip here. I'll take it straight out round that boy, no bother. We've got a good team here, and obviously we got the professional. So that's all that matters. I'm here. I think we shouldn't go for the outright win because we're going to leave ourselves in with nothing to aim for next year. So I am just looking top ten. <laughs> Great start. Yeah, that's the way you do it. David, where well, are we going to the come? Americans, I think we've got a really good chance of probably top five. With, with the, the crew we've assembled this year, I think we've got a really good chance of uh, on, the, on the podium, possibly. That's without the Americans. Without the Americans, yeah, 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 without the Americans. Gary, where are you predicting? Well, I wasn't here last year, so I haven't a clue, but I'm saying we're going to be at least fifth.
How'd you get on? I think we got 10th place. Yes, I think Gareth and Austin. Yes, yes, 10th place. So that, that, that was my prediction at the start to be in the top 10. <laughs> I can't feel my shoulders, unfortunately. One better than, uh, than we did with the American last year. Um, unfortunately, there was a bit of skullduggery from a few other boats that uh, lassoed us and started pulling us back to get a bit of traction for themselves. So, uh, other than that, I think we got a prediction of top five would have came true, but a um, bit of a rough start too. I think David and uh, David sort of had a bit of a, what would you call it? Slow feet. Oh, uh, trying to get onto the boat, which was proved to be difficult for him. I think next year we're going to improve the boat by putting a step ladder on it. <laughs> Maybe a, a stair lift. A stair lift will be good, Aye. as long as it's not electric. <laughs> <laughs> well done.